Hi there, it's Keith with the login uh, tab video and uh, this is really really straightforward. You'll only need to do this once and you may need to do it depending on your computer settings uh, when we do updates. So they're the only times that you'll need to do it. It's wise to keep your passwords and uh, usernames in a, uh, a safe location so you can find them easily and uh, nice and easy. So the username will be uh, your PayPal address or your Clickbank address depending on which one you've used when you actually make the uh, purchase of the software so if it's PayPal it will be your PayPal email if it's Clickbank it will be the Clickbank email that you've used in there now if you've paid for it through Clickbank and used PayPal again it will be your PayPal address so just pop that in pop in the password that the system generates for you and this password isn't changeable um, so you'll need to pop in the exact one it's best to cut and paste that because sometimes a zero looks like an O and uh, sometimes we uh, we don't get the results we need when we do that once you've done that go in and exit the software once you've exited it go back in and click on the icon that's on your desktop and you'll be right to go and this will all be open and you'll be at the source files page nice and easy and then you can start to uh, create some sites uh, and I'll see you on the next video bye for now